Welcome to RenewEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. Climate change, indisputably, is the defining crisis of the 21st century, and the effective management of greenhouse gas (GHG) emissions is central to the resolution of this crisis. In response to this need, the World Resources Institute (WRI) and the World Business Council for Sustainable Development (WBCSD) developed the Greenhouse Gas (GHG) Protocol an international standard for GHG accounting and reporting. The GHG protocol provides a comprehensive, standardized framework for calculating and reporting GHG emissions from a wide range of sources. It offers various methodologies, each addressing different aspects of GHG accounting and reporting. Its widespread adoption across organizations, businesses, and governments worldwide underscores its integral role in enhancing our understanding of GHG emissions and informing mitigation efforts. Section 1 the corporate standard. The GHG Protocol Corporate Standard is a comprehensive, step-by-step -step guide for corporations to measure and report their GHG emissions. It includes guidelines on setting organizational boundaries, identifying and calculating GHG emissions, tracking emissions over time, and accurately reporting these emissions. One of the defining features of the corporate standard is the categorization of emissions into three scopes. Scope 1 emissions are direct emissions from sources owned or controlled by the company. Scope 2 emissions are indirect emissions resulting from the consumption of purchased electricity, steam, heat, or cooling. Scope 3 emissions include all other indirect emissions occurring in a company's value chain. The corporate standard is vital for any corporation committed to being part of the climate change solution. It aids in setting and achieving emission reduction targets, managing GHG risks and opportunities, and reporting progress to stakeholders. Section 2. The Scope 3 Standard the Scope 3 standard is an extension of the corporate standard that provides a detailed approach for corporate value chain accounting and reporting. It allows organizations to thoroughly understand their comprehensive carbon footprint, including upstream and downstream emissions. By doing so, it helps organizations identify hotspots, engage suppliers, design effective reduction strategies, and capitalize on the associated benefits. Section 3. The Product Lifecycle Standard the GHG Protocol Product Lifecycle Standard provides guidance for companies to assess GHG emissions associated with the entire life cycle of a product. This covers all stages from raw material extraction, through material production, manufacturing, distribution, use, to end-of-life treatment. It's designed to assist companies to identify emission hotspots along their product life cycles, enabling them to focus their efforts on areas where emission reductions can be most effective. Section 4. Sector Guidance the GHG protocol provides additional guidance for certain industries with unique sources of emissions. For instance, it includes a sector-specific standard for the agriculture, forestry, and other land use, a FOLU, sector. This standard provides comprehensive guidance on how to measure and manage GHG emissions from FOLU activities. Likewise, for the oil and gas industry, which has unique sources of GHG emissions and faces specific challenges, the GHG protocol developed a separate standard to guide their GHG accounting. Section 5. City and Community Standard Recognizing the crucial role that cities play in addressing climate change, the GHG protocol developed the City and Community Standard. This standard provides a framework for cities to measure and manage their GHG emissions. It covers all emissions within a city's geographic boundary, plus those emissions occurring outside the boundary that are linked to activities within the city. Section 6. Project Protocol The GHG protocol also includes a project protocol, which provides a robust framework for quantifying and reporting GHG reductions from specific projects or initiatives. These can range from renewable energy or energy efficiency projects to forestry or methane capture projects. By offering a transparent, credible, and consistent method for quantifying project-level emission reductions, the Project Protocol aids organizations in verifying and reporting the GHG benefits of their projects. Section 7. Evolving Needs and Emerging Methodologies As our understanding of the climate crisis deepens and its complexities unfold, the GHG Protocol continues to adapt, evolve, and add to its suite of tools. For example, it recently introduced the Scope 2 guidance, a new standard that addresses how corporations should measure and report emissions from purchased electricity. Conclusion The GHG protocol represents an extraordinary effort to standardize the way we measure, manage, and report GHG emissions. Through its holistic, comprehensive approach, it offers a clear path for businesses, governments, and other organizations to navigate the complex landscape of climate action.
from enabling businesses to understand their carbon footprint, providing industries with tailored guidance, empowering cities to become climate leaders, and facilitating accurate reporting of GHG reductions from projects, the GHG protocol has made an indelible mark in the fight against climate change. As the need for robust, credible, and transparent GHG accounting continues to grow, the GHG protocol will undoubtedly remain a cornerstone in the global response to the climate crisis. As we venture deeper into the Anthropocene, tools such as the GHG protocol will be ever more critical in guiding our path to a sustainable, low-carbon future. Thank you for choosing RenewEnergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, visit us at RenewEnergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.